And I say, wow, all the vibes. And give thanks for life. And next day we're doing it again. Good afternoon. It's been a long time. Monique, remember me say you have a new baby. Make up yourself. Go on hold tight. God of his mercy. Sophia, why are you still up on my page and watch my business? After my black here. Yo, God, no. I black that woman and she's still up on my page. Medical spa. Remember, from come look for you in the store, I'm going to back, you know. You done it, me. How are doing, gentle people? Say, a long time, you may say, a long time, you know, come on for life. And I said, big, dirty, stinking, shabba. See me ya. But there ya. Mama and papa. And Gandhi see me and I shout, lion, pa. I know me there ya. Yeah. Things change. I can't come on for life like one time. I have to make one know that sometimes too much things go on on the internet and man and a blogger, you see me? But you know, we just come on and just make a little appearance more time. But tell the reason why I come on for life. I say a little thing with one girl. And I don't know how far the life is go, but I hope it reaches to who it's supposed to reach to. Um, me is a father, right? I'm mean, a very responsible father. I am a responsible parent. And when you're a parent, we are supposed to be responsible for our child, our children, until the end of time. When I say response for them, like we still have a dead and a care how old them get. I realize a thing where in a certain parts of Jamaica, Mostly the inner city where fathers and mothers just because they play a role in sending the child to school which is their responsibility. As soon as the child reads 16 or even 18 them start force the child to take care of house. And when we say take care of house, take care of their finances. And I know it is wrong because the generational curse where we're supposed to break, it's not being broken. And we come to talk about it. No foundation never set for me as a youth. But my mother was always there where she never give up her. My father always write me letter and all of them things. Then I tell me how to be a good man and how to grow and how to not take up crime and not take up this and me just for do certain things. I always a rush to get big. And I say, wait till I get big, I go this and when I go get that and when I go do this and when I go that. See? So I get big now. Because I remember saying, no, I say, when I want to go to school, I want to start work. So I take up music, love music. I do every other work. I work a case roofing. I work a Raymar's furniture. I work a national bakery. I try to learn trade with over, over, over food, over, over Brentford furnishing. When Dr. Ford did own a furniture place there, I learn trade over there. So. Right? One of the time I go to and get a trade work with the next man where I weld in him do. And you have to put on the something over your face and the light will flash. Because if you don't put on the something over your face, you will blind. See? So I do the whole of them something there. Bam, I turned father in a 97. Two youth I get one time. Nobody never tell me, say, boy, it's not easy for raise one but two youth. Nobody never teach me that. See? Nobody not teach me that, you know. But I want to be father, I want to turn man. Not knowing, say, when my granny used to tell me, say, don't rush to get big. Take your time and grow. I never understand. Even the part where she said, look somewhere before you. Look somewhere to put your head before you put your cock. I never did it. just time to get big. Because here I didn't want to get big for. I want to get big for a party. I want to get big for other road as I like. 
Now, nah, say I want to get big for have responsibility, you know. That are the part where we now teach the youth them. And that we have to teach them, say, once you get big, you only have one time to get big. One time you have to get big. Because bam, you're born. Then put you to sit down up. Till them start, put you to stand up, up and tell you to step off. Somehow we run off. Somehow we creep off. Somehow we do all kind of things as a baby. Bam, we reach that stage that where we turn one, we get turn two. We, we have, remember, in the older we are get, we now get younger, you know. We are get older. See? We are getting older, 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 older. Bam, you reach five. When you reach three, them start saying you go to school. Some youth start school from all two year old. Them start saying we go to school. The first thing we start learning is coloring. Them start telling you about color, yellow, green, blue, black, white, purple, pink. Them start teach with that. Because we have a coloring school. <laughs> See? We have a coloring school. Bam, we go to bam, because basic school we are going now. So we start learning. The, 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 like what I said, the wheels of the bus go round and round. They said the color of the bus is yellow. Because remember, we have only a yellow bus in Jamaica. So they tell you about the color of the bus and they tell you about. The plane in the sky, and I tell you about some one whole heap of thing, and we stay so bam, graduate at six. We start go to primary school now, because we are leave basic school and I go to primary school. We start go to school and now move from this, so because we are growing, we are get older. Here yeah, we are get older. We start learning to be with self, because when we are three and them age, the parents are bad with. They might carry go at their care, they might carry go get vaccination. They might carry go all of these places where I get older. We are growing up. We start go to school by ourselves. Some of us stop at early at school, some of us stop at secondary school, some of us stop at high school. Seeing some of us stop at university. Once you reach university, a big man stage is a ton now because you leave high school when you are 16. Seeing? You leave high school when you are 16. Now, I never go to high school because I start work from me at 15. Because I say, yo, I want things. I want shoes, I want clothes, I want to buy this, I want to buy that. I want to spend more money, nobody not give me no allowance. Again, the granny not teach you something then. She don't tell just tell us to stay in the yard. One thing my granny tell me, say, when you go outside and come in back, if you stay inside today and don't go out the next day, when you go out there, the same thing I go there out there. Remember that my granny tell me, and when I turn big man, I realize say, we don't have to run down out the street. When I turn big man. So the point that I try to make now, see? My mother never wanted nothing from me. All she wanted was the best for me. Always I tell me to go to school, always I tell me to learn this and learn that. Now how heartbreaking it is. To look on the internet and see a little girl just turn 18. So she sent out a whole heap of job application. And her father pressure her and I tell her if you go get a work. <laughs> right? Remember she had tried to get work, but the father tell her say a time for she start pay bills in the house. Not like she not an ambition and she don't want to get no work, you know. But the father a pressure her. What him should do is sit down and have patience with this little girl. Because him remember say him did look like she wants and remember things and time change it easy for she get misled. Because so much things are going on now upon social media where you have to hold your youth tight and reason with your youth. Because again, everybody feel like so them can go over TikTok but beg and talk about tap up the screen, tap up the screen, come on guys, come on guys, come on guys. I know everybody that I go work for. Tap up the screen guys, tap up the screen. That now go work for everybody. TikTok come out as a platform where show we say. Yes, we can go play a match. Yes, we can make money, but it was supposed to be fun. But everybody turn it in a competition now where them eat them one another and all of them something there. We see so much things on the internet where they look up at them. It's like them last them way. Because I remember when we was 13, you know. We did a pray for have soldier man. And, and board us in a gully. But now them 13 year old, where them are pre, them are pre for put on eyelash, them are pre for put on makeup, them are pre for put on piercing, them are pre for put on um short shot. If you notice, no, just check every little girl where you see now, where reach that age of 12, 11, 12. Just check how them wear them clothes. Everybody cut their jeans pants to short like them batty jar show. 
Every garrison want to pass. Just check. It's a summer now. Check when you see some of them little girls. Yeah. Belly, skin, top. And them pants cut. Every single one of them. You want to just check it. And just come back and come see say And a lie me I tell. All of them is doing the same thing. Blind a lead. Blind right show. You understand? Every little picnic now. Dying for get big for put on makeup. They're not even now wait. What them call it? Crap top. See somebody say crap top. They're crap top. Cross is that. See? So again, nakedness are the new light are the new limelight now. If you're not if you're not dressed naked as a little young girl, them say you're boring. I remember one time when they see some little girl in you know, them little church dress and them little church shoes and you know you can't tell say your man a little girl is well groomed and grown and rare. Judge, we used to judge too. You understand? But no, we are see it. We are see it. Because again, nobody knows asks nobody for an ID as long as, 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 as a 14 year old can big and put on her clothes and can't go to any one of the club, them boy. We can't get any dance because again, not for the open year dance, them keep. See? See, somebody just said shame the exist again there and that is so right. Morals and, uh, and them something. The people have it same way, but a little bit of people have it. Everybody just feel like, say, yo, look at embarrassment on the internet, man. all right. See? When I see the little girl go to the and say, she reach out to art and art them put her up on a list and she a wait and say them I go call and I'll know she no call. I know she no get no call and her father pressure her and she depressed. Like, me here say, she have an interview for get her for, 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 for her work tomorrow. I'ma feel good about that, but that's something when we well did want to talk about. Correct her what I go on. That's something when we did well want to talk about. I never nah, tell a lie because again, not for we are uh, we, we are parents, not for we don't turn parents yet, not for we us. It's like the internet show we. The internet nobody know. But the internet are show with people mindset. And the internet is the place where you eat if you draw your in if you're weak. You see me? The internet is the place where you draw your in if you're weak. So you as a parent, if you have a six year old or seven year old, you have to start nurture them from them time there. As long as them have sense, you have to start telling them the something them and tell them the pros and the cons of life. Tell them about the internet. Because again, every youth have a tablet. And when him have a tablet, ocean will go on. When you have a tablet, you see, you're you open to so much things. And everybody really watch them children where them have parental control over where the pitney watch. And the youth them even if you have parent control upon that, them find other ways for to do what them want to do. And I see now them have a, you see that something there? When them have when them disappearing message, when them have on WhatsApp, I want a worse thing too because you can't recover about nothing where, where, where they pick them delete. Or oh, you feel be a little 12 year old, 11 year old, and have disappearing message. What are you hiding? Who are you talking to? Who are you talking to that you are making your messages disappear? Remember, all parents want a reason. I'm going to listen to what I say. All parents. Remember, you are responsible for your child upbringing and your child well-being. What your child sees in the outside world, you don't have no control over it. Anything where you did a hide, them are going to see it. They are going to see it. So it's best for you to sit with them and talk with them because again, just like how would that tell we say, no go out the road and we feel wait before we have sex. Remember they used to tell we say, don't have sex before marriage and we feel don't have kids out of wedlock and all of the something them. Them tell we the whole of them something there. Now we are in a new age and a new time. We are in the cyber world now. The cyber world big and open up and kill it. So we are see so much thing. We say boy, a married boy, girl, a married girl. We see so much things. So, it's a different way to grow them youth, you know. Remember, say, if you look at no family house, where them have a little baby in it, remember, say, food in other house, they feed a pit in there. We see food in there, like, when we did little, we never see so much food. Because, again, one little girl of six cases of juice with fear herself. The way she see the juice, them and she, oh, mommy, that's yours. Mommy, work all of this for you. She just pull all six of them one time. Six juice one time, and she drink some, put on some, drink some, put on some. Remember when we did young, when we get one juice, we have to wall that. We get the best upgrade bringing out of everybody we attack. We, the generation where we are 40 and 50 now, we grow good. 
and we can't get back no care how we buy back the clothes, we buy back the mesh marina, we buy back the ballet, we buy back the chubby flax, the chubby fox, and all of them something there. We will never get back the upbringing where we get. I don't care how we instill it in our picnic. Look for a perfect example. Hurricane Beryl come the other day. And we was out of light. Somehow we still not get back light. My light go away for what, two days or so. But again, me did have a car. Some could have charged my phone in my car. See? So again, it not really. The storm never really do me nothing more than the light go away. But one to the other people. They go down to Manchester. I want to go down to Manchester. One part of Manchester now have no light. Couple people with us flood out down there. People want to signal for the phone because the pole drop down away down in a square. They have to go. Or Manchester Square. So my people in a royal flat, they made a figure. They get signal, pan them phone for make a call to them family. So again, what about the house them with everything are out of electricity? So you see again, we can't forget we roots. We cannot forget we roots. Our roots mash we up and all we can't afford a generator. I remember say a generator off it outside it can your house. People have generator and it kill them in the house because the fumes will come out of it. It's dangerous. We get some hard life, rum blood. We get some life where we buck off to them. You tell now we don't know about buck off to because we have make sure say them go to the road with them slippers or them shoes. When them say mommy or daddy, can I go outside to play? Can I go outside to play? And you say make sure you put on your shoes. Don't go outside without your shoes. Not for them you tell know what no, we know what like when them get a little scrape on them and them say mommy I got a boo boo. Daddy, I got a boo boo. We don't know nothing about a boo boo. A shit we know about. You know what I mean? So, the thing changed so much that everybody else run off. I remember when I see the ads are coming out. I ads the depth on the internet where a man have him house. Full electric. A fully electric run the house. Him garage and everything, you know. Him garage. Him Kiara, Telsa. Him everything. Electric. And a storm come. Same thing like a come with him. Remember all of them things you showed us now, pre you know. All of them things you show us so we mustn't. Remember we have a home sweet home lamb. Remember say the other day. Remember say can't gonna sell until storm come. But remember all people always tell us so we have to always prepare. Bam! Your door have your ring light on it. Everybody, Alexa, arm door. Alexa this and that. But when light gone, Alexa no work. Yes, a modern days, but we still have to remember we roots. Alexa, turn alarm up to this. Alarm, Alexa, set alarm to that. Uh, Alexa, blood clot can't work because light gone. Every house supposed to have matches in it. Every house supposed to have a little bottle of cursing in it. Every house supposed to have a coal stove. Every house supposed to have a gas stove. Every house supposed to have Every little thing where if light gone, we can survive. We don't remember how to survive. The old people, them don't remember how to survive. So all the young one them remember how to survive. The young one them just come and them see so much things and everything bright and beautiful. Because them go and say, Alexa, go on tell it to me. Alexa, go on this. Go on that. And Alexa, remember when the picnic can hear no Alexa, she ball. Whoa, he murder the end of the world I come. I talked to my brother a while ago. I'm looking baby in the car. I said she she hungry. Remember, him said the five minutes from him yard. And when he must say, Mommy, we're five minutes from home. The little baby said, No, I'm hungry now. I'm hungry. Hey. I said, One, two, three, four, five. Here the fake ball I go come. Remember when him tell her no, you know. Two times, you know. She threw a tantrum with beer fake ball in. Remember in our time when we look like hungry, we have a wallet. So people if you understand. No care what, we will never get back the times where we have when we're young. We know a modern technology time now, but we have to always remember we roots. One of the wickedest thing, I live a good era. I like go away. I don't light. And when I go down a jungle, down a jungle of light. People watch them TV and I live them life same way. I mean, I said, John was there. Whoa. And catch bad mind. Remember, you know, bad mind me catching up and go down to my yard, you know. Go down to my yard and them have light and everybody phone charge. And my phone has struggled. 
My phone has struggled, I catch a piece of bad mind. I say, what do people in a life? I don't deserve this. I never wore JPS one month yet. Whoa, Yambal. See? But, what may I say? We grew a certain way. Because again, we are living in an era now where if you wear your natural ear, people have problem with it. Because we are getting used to so much. Peruvian and Malaysian and Cambodian and all kind of Malaysian. We are getting used to so much of this. Right? I love my daughter bad. Because you know what I see my daughter do? My daughter wear her natural ear. She wear fox locks, you know. But she preserve her ear so much. The amount of can to treatment when my daughter pay and do her ear. When my daughter we are naturally big and spread out so Remember my daughter here big and spread out so like a big afro Right? So what I try to say is Miss Legal Nothing wrong with wearing falls here but your natural ear Cause remember when you wear too much falls here your natural ear Now get no chance for breed your natural ear now get a chance. So you need to give your ear, your natural ear, a chance. That is what I'm trying to say. Give your natural ear a chance. Breeze it sometime. No put on no ear. Remember again, everybody beautiful in their own way. Everybody beautiful in their own way. Because again, if it never did for sell, it will not sell. And it is the best seller. Big up all the wear birds, big up all the wear. Because first thing, let me tell some people this, if you don't understand. Anybody who wears a low cut ear, it's a lot of money to maintain low cut ear because every day you have to go fix it up. Right, Nikki? Remember, you have to pay to keep your low cut groom. Anybody who wear fox locks, you have to pay to keep that in tune because, again, fox locks is expensive. Remember when my daughter got university. And she said she want fox locks. At them, them time, they may pay seven fifty, seven hundred and fifty dollar for, 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 for one pack. And them time, the she use must be about eight pack in her ear. So me don't know how much feet now, cause she do her own ear now. God go with her, cause she have her own money now. See? But remember when me appear that is seven fifty. Don't a town me go to go buy the fox locks. See? So we have a little idea about certain things. Remember, say anybody where we wear braids. Birds is that thing where some birds they wear it two weeks, some birds they wear it a month. Right? So I understand, but it's expensive to be natural. It's just like a man who say I go vegan. Anybody who is vegan is very ex it, 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 it expensive. You understand? So again, when I try to say the youth them, too much followers they bought. Too much followers, a lot of followers they bought and no leaders not they bought. See, big up all of the all of who have themselves as a lead and really a lead. And here what we are doing wrong. We are look to social media for lead with bad mind Nikki. We in a my life. Member say social media, no for we are look for social media. Like when we see how some 60, 70 year old people have TikTok and over TikTok I ask people for blood clot, give them taps and them one go play match. You can't send me some coins. One time me used to kinds in five dollar and ten dollar kinds, but now them are telling us yo kind. Me need some kind. Remember in a COVID, they made from whole heap of man we go viral where say where, where one guy did put out him just up like woman and tell them say him a woman and get them because them say them want money and him say yo me let me see her ass and them skin out them ass and show the man them and the man them uh, and them, and this boy uh, ask them for money. Now. Before we get to that, right? I want to finish the conversation with the generation of where I go on now. With the youth then. Don't force your youth to come turn a helper to you. You're supposed to help a youth to help himself. You're supposed to raise your youth to survive. For themselves, not to come and take care of you. 
Well, you say you're proud of your youth because your youth graduated from school. Your youth graduated and now found themselves in the work world, in the work field. First thing you have to teach your youth is to open an account. Start teaching them to save from early. Buy your youth a saving pan. And when you buy your youth a saving pan, buy your youth a saving pan and teach them. Every time you give them a money, you make sure them put something in that pan. Because remember, you know, and them you save it for you know. Right? But you have to teach them how to save. You have to teach them responsibility from early. Just like your little daughter. Because I know found a big woman and everything. You don't know everything. And remember, none of you don't fully know everything either. When you have your youth, first thing is a girl teach me this one time. Because you know, nobody never teach me this. May I watch Peely Panty. And Peely Younger. May I watch Peely Panty. I may I wash it and then I say, may I wash it and then it on the line. When I go start hang it by the line, I hang it by the crutches. And she said, no, don't hang the panty by the crutches. Hang it by the side. Because remember, me a big man, you know, but I know everything I know. And a woman never did a teach me this. Like, me never know somebody that come wash the panty. You think everything machine can do. And when you can't afford a washing machine, don't you have to use your hand? See? So again, you know, as female, you have a young youth, them, and not everything you put in a machine. Stay safe, don't have Dubai. And not everything you put in a machine. The youth, them, for learn to wash them panty, and the boy, them, for learn to wash them boxers, use them, and I wash that. You have to make them learn something. And not everybody can afford to have a helper. Just like all unrated girl. We have help on the yard and make on the help wash on the dirty drawers. I want to wash on the drawers. No give no help on your drawers to wash girl. Most of you parents get up on the first thing. I want to say, remember if I did lock my foot here on the yard. If I did lock my foot here on the yard. Wah go and good as. Who is this? See? Him? Yeah, Tony. This is one of the words where the parents them love use. And use it against the pit them. If me did lock my foot and me could have dash away. Remember me could have lock my foot and suffocate you and you're dead. And remember me could have dash away. But again, me understand. Because enough of you women... I never the pit me on the wine, no. and the man on the one. So I have a resentment towards the pit me. And no found no man, only the dust one breed that woman and say, Yeah, man, I'm a baby mother. I've been around where you don't know. I wasn't staying low key, I was just busy. You know what I mean? Man, too old for stay low. Man, a six too. So we can't do, you know what I mean? Yeah, so enough man does did want to say, Yeah, man, I'm a baby mother. That but well, remember, everything comes with consequence. Anything where you do, you have to prepare for pay the price. If I go there, do go to follow you or follow your generation. It might not reach back you, but it reach back your generation. But you have to make sure say so you do good. If I bad, you do because enough times some things happen to some people around, and and of them do not need somebody for them do it, you know, and of them pay the price, you know. That's why them always are tell about the boy rascal at Kwaku, you know. When them tell us if you can't catch Kwaku, you catch him shot, you know. That's why I'm glad the boy shot can't fit me, you know. Kwaku close can't fit me. See? So, I tell me, I tell you, say, the generation gap, it come like it get fucked. Because again, the 13 year old and the 14 year old and the 15 year old, all them do a prayer to get big. But tell them this you only have one time to get big. Once you get big, I hit that. Enjoy your youth, enjoy your teenage years.